goals. So um, just with the, the kind of more experienced Nogi grapplers, we're looking at the guillotine position. A uh, couple of slight adjustments when we're working our arm in. We're really making sure that the elbows are flared out because this is where uh, we don't have the same amount of strength. There's also more gap as well. So anytime we bring our elbows back, we're actually closing the gap using our pec or biceps. So the first thing that we're doing is getting into the position, we're sliding this hand over, so his throat's resting in here. This hand's going on the inside, so it's attaching in this position. Pull through a little bit with this elbow, then this elbow has to come back, as well as this elbow. Coming out to the side slightly. As I sit, I'm on my side in this position, and then I'm just squishing in to finish my guillotine. If I miss this to stop the roll when Corey rolls, I'm going to try and keep control of this arm as he rolls over. The key is to try and get this hand just past his armpit, yeah, to then go into my, uh, my main naked choke position. Sometimes this can be a little hard, so if his arm's up, I'm just going to bring this knee over, bring down a little bit more, it's just going to help me cinch up the, the gate roll a little bit more. So keep everything nice and tight, elbows in, and start bringing my belly towards his belly button, just to finish the choke.